Technology continues to take on a greater role in our everyday lives. And nowhere is that more evident than in how we educate our children. More now in this week's One Class at a Time. Ten, that's right, you're making combinations of ten. Do you see a combination anywhere? First grade teacher Caitlin Hollis is always helping her students find the right combination at Fultondale Elementary. Since these kids were born into the video game generation, one combination that usually works is learning through something visual. My students love the fact that I incorporate the Promethean board every day in lessons. We do reading with that, we do math with that. They get free time to be able to play and explore on it. Um, and I think they respond very well. Her first grade students should respond even better now that Mrs. Hollis has been presented with a $1,000 grant. This week's One Class at a Time winner says funding is key these days just to keep up with the state's basic requirements. So this is going to help me get computer software that they can use for math and reading because what I have now is very outdated for the new Common Core standards and everything else that they've come up with this year. Mrs. Hollis says her students really thrive when they're using the hands-on or touchscreen technology like this Promethean board next to me. That's why the one class at a time grant money will really come in handy. I have two working computers and then um, all I have is the Promethean board. So bringing in more technology to make them more technology ready for, you know, for the 21st century and everything else. Congratulations to Mrs. Hollis and Fultondale Elementary, our co-sponsors for the One Class at a Time project, or Pepsi and America's First. And if you would like to apply, simply head to CBS42.com.